Okay, using the Starcraft heat press for the first time, it takes about 10 to 15 minutes to heat up. I This is the 100% polyester. I did my sublimation print, mirrored, and then I have, so it has the heat pad. It has it comes, I'll show you in a minute, the, the, the sponge, and then in between the fabric, I have two sheets of butcher paper. I have this down. I'm going to put two more pieces, and I set my temperature for three... 85 I'm gonna do 45 seconds just because this is the material that had previously burned and then I'm also gonna do this as well because there's quite a bit of, of pressure and I did my heat tape as well so let's just see how this goes I hope that this works well and then I don't know how to actually okay and then maybe we'll go ahead and put it down. And then now the time is going. It definitely takes a lot of power. I think I have a lot of stuff in here anyways, but my lights are like kind of flickering. Some people I've seen do this at 400 for 60 seconds, but this is the material, the polyester that had previously burned that I did, this one. You'd see on the outside. So I just, I wanted to take it down a notch because it, it is, I mean, you could feel the heat blazing and we will go from there. And I didn't prep the shirt at all because in regards, I mean, other than, than um, the lint roller, I'm scared. So it feels warm and it's kind of tricky, honestly, cause this is very hot. Um, so it's kind of tricky in regards to getting everything centered. Let's see. I may need to um, let's see. I'm scared. Oh, it looks good. See, that's like the thing. I'm... Oh, it looks it looks very good. That looks good. I have one to put on the back, so let's go ahead and get that started. I'm gonna flip it over. It looks good. It looks really good. See, I think it was a good decision. 100 percent polyester, 385 for 45 seconds with all the barriers I put on there. Let's flip it over and put the emblem on the back. So I got the second part. Um, basically, I'm doing a little like symbol on the back. So I have, this is very hot. So I have my two sheets of, of um, butcher paper and then that heating film and then my heat tape and my sublimation mirrored image. And then I'm going to go ahead and... Just align this like so, sorry. Let's line this, this kind of crooked. Okay. And then, oi. And then go. That looked a little crooked, but hopefully. We'll see. I have other products as well. I would like to try. Like I found these at the Dollar Tree. Um, they're a hundred percent polyester. They're dog scarves. So I want to try something on that. And then I got um the I got some cups. I got this 
I got some different cups, so I want to try that. Okay, let's go check this out. I'm scared a little bit because this was a smaller area. And I don't know. And I didn't prep this shirt, like I said, because it of of previously my previous experience with this material of overheating. Um and it is hot. Okay. Oh, it looks good. Oh, hot. Yeah. That looks good. So, yeah. I mean, you could t definitely tell it's all even. Um, it looks great. Like the press for sure. I mean, this is going to get used to like instead of just like a straight up and down, a swing around is actually you're just, you know, I'm going to have to get used to it, but it works really, really, really well. Like there is no issue between, I'll show you. Um, it does get very, very hot. So let me, um, let me show you. Hold on. I'm just gonna let those fall to the floor. And then I'm gonna show you really quick. Yeah, you could, you could kind of see where on this one I had did in two different areas. So you could kind of see the difference between the inks. This was, I did it, well, I was just learning as well. But I think you learn the materials. And then on this one specifically, it's 100% um, polyester. So it's more thin material and it's very soft. So I had pressed this one at 400, I think for 60 seconds with the Cricut, not, yeah, um, flat heat press. And that's why I think you get the two different colors as well because it's hard to keep the like same amount of pressure. So the 15 by 15 heat press, there's no issue at all. Like, and then I had all those barriers, but I, it's because of previous experience and the image itself like I don't want you to be confused because it has it's like cracked and aged that's what I wanted so yeah it oh wait you could kind of see a little bit now that it's sitting a little bit longer let's see oh no that was just the hanger okay okay so yeah so far so good I have a lot more I dropped that paper on more to do but I think for now it's it's pretty late so I'm gonna go ahead and I just at least wanted to do a shirt and I'm pretty impressed that's my first so that's my first shirt and I would say I'm very impressed like all the colors are right on 